OpenAI, the company behind ChatGPT, is now being sued in a class action lawsuit for allegedly stealing tons of people's data and profiting from it. You may have heard about ChatGPT4, a cutting-edge language model created by OpenAI, and its amazing potential. It was planned to be the apex of AI-driven communication, superior to all of its predecessors in terms of intelligence and language comprehension. However, it unexpectedly experienced a serious setback, a degradation that left the AI community perplexed and curious about what had happened. As we explore the world of GPT-4 and learn about its performance stability, please join us. The remarkably expansive language model GPT-4 serves as the foundation for the chatbot prototype called ChatGPT-4. It is the most recent and sophisticated AI system from OpenAI and employs AI technology to generate text that resembles human speech, GPT. 4's predecessor, ChatGPT-3, was regarded as the best language model prior to its introduction. It was launched just four months before GPT-4, demonstrating the astonishing speed at which technology is evolving in the field of artificial intelligence. The most recent model in OpenAI's line of language models, known as Generative Pre-Trained Transformers, is GPT-4. It is a neural network that has been rigorously trained on massive quantities of data and is intended to be an incredibly strong and flexible tool for creating text, GPT. 4 has been enhanced such that it can recognize intricate patterns in natural language and generate extremely sophisticated text outputs by integrating cutting-edge machine learning algorithms. How, though, does this vary from ChatGPT-3? That's the next thing we'll look at. GPT-4's capacity to now recognize both text and graphics as input is by far the most significant change. Compared to the previous feature, this one is a big improvement. It gives the model the ability to handle content that is available in several formats, creating additional use cases like analyzing image input. An extensive library of textual material from several sources, including books, essays, Wikipedia, web texts, and other online sources, was used to train the model. Through this thorough training, ChatGPT gains the capacity to respond to and understand a wide range of prompts and queries. While OpenAI has not made public how many parameters GPT-4 was trained on, several sources indicate that it was close to 100 trillion. It is known that 175 billion parameters were used to train GPT-3. That is around 571 times more than that. This astounding improvement results in increased output accuracy and precision, which makes it perfect for performing more complicated jobs and producing extremely precise outputs. Although ChatGPT-3 is an amazing language model already, its word count is restricted to a maximum of 3,000 for both input and output. However, ChatGPT-4 is setting a new standard with its incredible 25-000 word capacity for both input and output. This implies that the model's capacity to handle increasingly difficult tasks and generate better output outcomes is enhanced by the inclusion of more parameters and prompts as input. Furthermore, GPT-4 outperforms GPT-3.5 by 40% when it comes to generating factual answers. Even if there are still limitations, this is a major advancement that lessens the possibility of hallucinating facts. ChatGPT is evolving, but it's been very difficult to pinpoint how or why. Many users have expressed dissatisfaction about the GPT-4 language model's gradual degradation, resulting in erroneous responses and a refusal to obey commands that it previously complied with. This model powers OpenAI's premium chatbot. According to recent research, AI has undergone significant modifications, though perhaps not in the ways that people had anticipated. Do you know about the current rumors concerning the possible degradation of ChatGPT-4? Let us know your comments. Researchers from Stanford University and UC Berkeley claim that the GPT-4 and GPT-3.5 respond differently now than they did a few months ago, and not always in a positive way, in a recent work that was released in the RxCiv preprint database. It was discovered by the researchers that GPT-4 was producing far less accurate responses to some more difficult math problems. Large-scale prime number queries were almost always answered properly by the system in the past, but more recently, 
it only answered the identical question correctly, 2.4% of the time. Though the bot's more recent iterations were considerably less likely to provide a detailed solution, even when asked, older iterations provided a more in-depth explanation of how they worked. While it was still quite limited in its ability to address more complex code production, the older version, GPT 3.5, actually got significantly more capable of answering basic math issues in the same period of time this year, from March to June. There has been a lot of conjecture on the internet regarding whether ChatGPT is deteriorating with time. Some frequent ChatGPT users on websites like Reddit and others have been openly questioning if the GPT-4 powered chatbot is becoming worse or if users are just becoming more aware of the system's limits over the past few months. Some users complained that the bot would frequently write complete fiction instead of following instructions to reorganize a document. Others pointed out that the algorithm might falter on quite easy problems, like arithmetic or coding queries. For the first time since the app's launch last year, ChatGPT engagement may have decreased in part as a result of some of these complaints. It seemed that the most recent version of GPT-4 was less accurate when answering questions about spatial reasoning. Furthermore, the researchers discovered that similar to a college student experiencing senioritis, GPT-4's coding proficiency has declined. Only 10% of the code in the most recent version followed the guidelines provided by the online code learning platform LeetCode, which the team used to provide its replies. 50% of such code was executable in the March version. Researchers Matei Zaharia and James Zhu stated that compared to earlier iterations, the modern answers would have more base text and more code modifications would be necessary. OpenAI has praised the LLM's capacity to reason in multiple choice assessments. Nonetheless, the program's human evil Python coding test result was only 67%. However, businesses looking to integrate a chat GPT to coding stack pipeline face challenges as a result of the modifications made to GPT-4. The language model's evolution over time also demonstrates the difficulties faced by anyone depending on the proprietary, opaque AI of a single corporation. When utilizing AI chatbots like ChatGPT-4, have you personally encountered any restrictions or problems? If so, how do you think these limits might be resolved? The Vice President of Products at OpenAI, Peter Wellender, has responded to the recent online rumors about the capabilities of its GPT-3.5 model and the potential of its more recent GPT-4 model with a direct rejection. He reaffirmed that OpenAI had not purposefully developed GPT-4 dumber in order to encourage the adoption of its more compact GPT-3.5 architecture. According to the researchers' claims, GPT-3.5 has seen no notable modifications other than fine-tuning, and OpenAI is not favoring this older model over others. A plausible explanation for the conjecture could be that GPT-3.5 is more economical to operate because of its smaller size in comparison to GPT-4. Wielander's statement, however, highlights that OpenAI is not compromising the capabilities of its more recent model in order to encourage customers to choose the less expensive, older model. Rather, Wellinder credits the rising number of people interacting with the AI chatbot for raising awareness of ChatGPT's performance constraints. Users of the system may run into scenarios where the model is unable to respond to their requests in a way that is pleasant or accurate as more people use it. This is an inevitable byproduct of the model's shortcomings, which can be addressed in due course by additional study and updates. Nevertheless, the researchers took into account the possibility that even minor modifications to the model that emphasize more customized replies could have a significant influence on the AI's behavior. Zhu and Zaharia stated that they intend to conduct a much more comprehensive investigation that can potentially touch on the modifications occurring with the LLMs of other businesses. Comparing GPT-4 to March versions of the language model, researchers discovered that GPT-4 was less likely to respond with a lengthy anti-discrimination message. Despite the potential downgrading of GPT-4, there are several ways for the model to bounce back and remain relevant in the AI landscape. First and foremost, focusing on its existing strengths is key, 
GPT-4 is still a robust and powerful language model, excelling at generating high-quality creative content. Additionally, it can be leveraged for various tasks like translation, summarization, and question answering, making it a versatile tool for users. To recover from any perceived limitations, GPT-4 must adapt to the evolving needs of users. As users become more sophisticated in their expectations, GPT-4 can continually learn and improve to meet these demands effectively. Improving user friendliness is also crucial so that users can extract the maximum benefit from the model with ease. Moreover, collaboration with other language models can be instrumental in GPT-4's recovery. By working together and pooling resources, language models can create more potent and comprehensive tools. This synergy ensures GPT-4 stays ahead of the curve, remaining a valuable and reliable resource for users. In conclusion, GPT-4 can overcome any perceived downgrade by capitalizing on its strengths, adapting to user needs, improving user friendliness, and engaging in fruitful collaborations with other language models. By embracing these strategies, GPT-4 can maintain its relevance and continue to serve as a valuable AI tool for users worldwide. Stay with us as we continue to dig deeper into the mystery surrounding ChatGPT-4's downgrade. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any exciting updates. Let's embark on this fascinating journey together.